Wow, YouTube, look at that. Look at all that water underneath that racing bar. Oh my. It's been raining like all friggin' night and all day. And holy crap. It's freaking raining. Freaking raining its ass off on here. Let's see if I can get this set right. Alright, so. As promised. Let's see how it works. Obviously, the problem's not solved. Things are really better than they were before. So, uh, let's see if I can show you these here. Hold on, let me take the camera off the tripod here. Put the light on the hood of the car, and you can look at it. So. See, that one's all Kenny Wampus. The Hillens County Wampus with the uh, shaving peeled back, so, you know, freak sakes, freak sakes, I don't know, maybe the feed throat's junk, but, uh, it was a good little gun, but, <clears throat> like I say, you know, so I did the stock, uh, there in the fall, but, You know, so looks like the Ruger 1022 will be coming soon. You'll be seeing videos about that. I'll be getting one because uh, you know. I mean, it, this gun has history, so I'm not gonna get rid of it. It's the first gun, the only gun my father ever bought me, and uh, only paid 40 bucks for it. I guess the guy. Uh, oh, we won't go into that. But anyway, so I'm gonna keep it. Maybe a nice conversation piece in the gun cabinet. Be alright for going hunting squirrel and that. I mean, you know. Once you have the first shot loaded in there. I mean, come on. If you miss the first shot, really. Squirrel's running up the tree. You're not going to get him. He's in defense mode and he's gone, so. I mean, you know. But, um. I'm, I'm talking about getting a, a Ruger. 1022, I hope you can still see me, but my question is, tubers, I don't know how many of you out there have this, but, uh, my options, I'm looking at, uh, obviously the Ruger 1022, everybody loves it, it's just wonderful, you know, everybody says it's great, best thing ever, I don't know, never shot one, never even held one, but, uh, my buddy who runs a gun shop says, uh, you know, get the Remington 597, you'll like it. It's got a new 30 round clip out for it. So, I'm thinking about the 597. And I've been told Marlin makes a 795, which is something like this, but it takes you have a 25 round clip and put on it. So, tubers, leave me a comment. Let me know. 1022 or the 597 Remington? And it doesn't matter what the stock looks like, because eventually I'm going to get a tactical stock. Uh, my buddy was telling me about one. I can't even remember what it's called now. I said get it. And uh, I've looked at the Archangel stocks. I've been looking at stocks. Because you know, once I get it, I'm going to change out the stock eventually. Make it look pretty cool. Like it's an assault rifle or something. But uh, So, I want to know what you think, tubers. I want to know. I mean, I like my Marlin 60, but I uh, 
need something different now. I'm gonna put this one there. Uh, it's gonna go to retirement. But uh, so yeah. So please, please tell me what you think. If you got a 1022 and uh, you'd sleep with it every night because it's so reliable and faithful, you know, let me know. If, same thing for the Remington. I want to know what's what. You know, before I go dropping three hundred dollars, I want to know what's a good gun. I mean, uh, and uh, you know, my buddy. They'll let me do a layaway on it. Uh, make payments, reasonable payments at reasonable times. But uh, I don't want to buy something I'm not going to like. You know? I need to know. Thanks, tubers. Have a good day.